Today is the first day of school for the boys and it's gonna be interesting. Here we are in Ljubljana uh, in our house for the next uh, few weeks, at least for the month of uh, September. It's a nice small uh, townhouse in the city center of Ljubljana and I will give you a tour later in the video. But for now it's 6 Yes, it's 6.30 in the morning and we have to get ready for school. So that's the first school day, 1.0 because we're gonna also gonna have a first day uh, in Japan But they are looking really pretty, that's their uh, kind of uniform Because they won't get this uh, uniform of the school Because for one month there is no, no point So we bought something that looks like their uniform Are you happy to go to school? Yes! Do you have a fear? Yes! No, Mark, you are happy to go to school? Yes! But no, it's going to be fine, don't worry, you're going to learn English like a fool Yes, I'm sorry Hi, Igo editing here. I just wanted to say that I didn't bring my big camera to the school, obviously I wanted to keep it low key, so I just didn't film anything, so let's get back to the video. So Anya, what's your first impressions? First day of school? Le first let's say, I didn't say before in the, in, the, in the video. I didn't say in the video before that it's British international school. It's an all English school, so they're gonna get classes in English. Just to say the point why we enrolled our kids in that school, because we have one month left or to wait yes. until we enter Japan. In Japan, Zach and Mark in Nagoya, they will go to international school that will be in English and Japanese language. So and because their English is not good or it's, it's inexistent zero, yes. yeah. So they're gonna get an intensive intensive learning hours of um, one English on one. and also they're gonna have all the classes in English and that's something that's really important for me and Igor for our kids to learn to get prepared since we have to wait why not uh, use this month to prepare also ourselves but mostly Isaac and Mark and they are gonna be in school because and gonna be in school, we don't yes. want them to be at home all month we yes. want them to to have a feeling that the school started it's gonna be really interesting to see how much they, uh, they can learn they in progress one in one month yes. uh, because they start with just uh, hello my name is Zach and we will see what they are gonna be capable to say in the end of September and maybe maybe at the end of the month of September they're gonna vlog with me and they're <laughs> gonna in answer in English and uh, be reactive ah. and I don't I don't think so but I, at least maybe they're gonna understand what we are talking about I just want to say that I'm really really afraid uh, for them not, not afraid but just like a mom you know I'm a little bit like how it's gonna be for them when we left Mark it was a uh, on the verge of, of, of crying of crying and and then and, and the teachers were already you know only English speaking with them Mark doesn't understand anything she was saying I think that's the good way to learn a language uh, to be uh, immersed in the in the language the good side is we were speaking yesterday almost all the kids that they, they come there they are from different countries often have uh, kids that come that doesn't speak English at all like Mark and Zach and after a few months they are not fluent they are not fluent, but they are uh, better, and uh, that's that's the, the the most important thing, I guess, because it means that the teachers are good and uh, the they progress the, the way. So we're gonna go because okay, guy is guy getting, guy is uh, getting uh, annoyed by by us, and uh, yes, we are a little bit stressed, but I hope it's gonna be good, and uh, we see us after when we come back home, and I will show you a, a tour of the house we're gonna stay for the month. See us later. <laughs> Here we are back home, but if I'm honest and totally transparent with you, we are not the same day, we are two or three days later. Because the other day I wanted to show you the, the place and I just said, and she was right, that the house was a mess because we were in a hurry in the morning to bring the, the boys to school. And since it's getting colder here in Ljubljana, we needed to find the warmer clothing. We were in a hurry, so we just pulled everything out of our seven bags and it was a mess, it was uh, clothing all over the floor, the beds and things like this. So yeah, Anya said let's clean the house a bit before we show them. 
so we did it it's a bit tidier now so let's check the place so here we are that's the entry nothing special you have here stairs that leads obviously upstairs to the rooms on the right you have the living room you already maybe saw a bit of it with the kitchen so this is uh, we are normal people washing our stuff so yeah uh, a small uh, living space a small couch for us five eating area here's the kitchen small but really nice kitchen when you go back here on the right you have a nice bathroom let it be light uh, nothing fancy here i like these bulbs here Hop. they look really nice that's me let's go upstairs and by the way when you go upstairs the first thing when we went upstairs with the boys the first thing that zach noticed is this picture right next to me i will show you Um, I'm speechless. I mean, Zach asked me what it's supposed to show. I guess it's art. Let's continue. Here is Zach sleeping and next to him is Mark's area. And on this side we have another bathroom. Usual stuff, toilets, shower there. And when we go here we enter in our room. Gaia's room. A lot of closet space here which is nice so we can put everything out of the bags until we leave one two three four and there behind is another five big bag and a sixth one there i like i said seven six so that's it uh, for the house tour it's not a big house there's not so much to show it's a really nice house we are loving it here especially we are in the center we can go almost anywhere on foot uh, the only thing i will say that's missing is the fact that there is no garden or balcony or outside area where we can put you saw the, the rack for uh, hanging our clothes but that's just temporary we know why we are here and that's also why it's not a big deal for us because we know that we are living here just for a few weeks and hopefully not much more now it's almost two o'clock in the afternoon the boys are in school until 14 45 and it's now time slowly to pick them up and to see their reactions what they think of the school how they feel i have a thing or two i want to say but i want to ask them first if they, if it's okay for me to to share it with you so let's go get the boys Oui, moi. Tu as des copains Oui, moi. Ça vous fait plaisir d'y aller ou pas Oui, moi. C'est juste la journée qu'elle est trop longue pour moi. Trop longue Parce que j'ai pas l'habitude, parce que ça fait depuis longtemps que je ne peux pas aller à l'école. Mais sinon, c'est bien quand même, vous avez déjà des copains, des gens avec q